So we're in the last round of the production. Um, at this point, what would your attitude be towards aging and age? Uh, has it changed throughout the, the process? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No, for me it's only the, the um, thought very important that we in Germany, everybody's getting older and um, in, I don't know, 30 years there won't be a lot of young people and that's for me very scary. And yeah, that's a point I, I actually didn't know or I didn't get in contact with that um, point and um, now, yeah, it's scary. It, I don't know, it, I don't think that will be a good future. <laughs> so we have to change something about that. So if you could do it, if you were a politician, let's say, what would be a you politician? What would be a political statement from your political act from your party? Mm, um, to give everybody the opportunity that there are good, um, yeah, um, that there are good opportunities to get a good education, and there's uh, enough money, and that uh, young, fa like young people, they don't um, have to be scared. Um, okay, what am I going to do with my child? Where I can where the kindergarten? That this everything is very good organized. Um, yeah, maybe that would be one point. Yeah. <laughs> We'd like to have that here. <laughs> okay, so yeah, but in Germany it's also not very good organized. I mean, maybe better than here, I don't know. But it's still heavy, you know? Yeah. yeah. Uh, what do you think as an actress, what do you think are the advantages or the assets of being able to explore this uh, issue of aging through theater? For me, the advantage is um, to play with different um, figures, to play different characters. And in one time, you play like an old lady, and then you really play young, young woman or a child. Um, and yet, to you know how how do they think? How do they move? And um, yeah, that's a challenge to to do that in, in a very quick way. So because the performance is only 60 minutes and. Um, yeah, and also what what are their what what kind of problems do they have, and what kind of problems do I have in my age now, or yeah, what yeah, like this. <laughs> Great. Um, let's try to imagine something. If you were the main character in the Romanian folk tale of youth without old age, you know the baby who needs to be convinced to come into the world mm -hmm. because it's such a short run. <laughs> what would convince you? Me, mm -hmm. a lot of things because I like to live here, I really like my life and maybe, yeah, the biggest thing is love <laughs> and the nature because I just came from, my, from holiday now and the nature was uh, such, it was so great and it really makes me free so and yeah, I would like maybe talk about that <laughs> to my child which is coming to, yeah, yeah. I like my life, so there are a lot of things. <laughs> Great. We're in the last round of the production uh, process. Uh, what uh, is at this point your personal attitude towards age and aging? Has it changed throughout the process? Um, in this project, there's a lot of thinking about getting older, or being old, or being young in a group or in a society. And, um, Yes, this is new for me. It's not a topic I think about it, I thought about it before. So of course there's something changing in my mind, but it's not it's not finished yet. It's in the it's in process. What process. Is the process. Yes, and then I'm, I'm very interested. I'm looking forward to see what um, where it ends. That's as an artist, but um, I also ask Sophia what uh, what do you think are the advantages of exploring this theme through theatre as an actor? Um, I guess, um, of course, to play some somebody who's older is, of course, it's very interesting to to um, to to feel it with your body and what what does it what does it make with your voice or oh, of course with your thinking and and this is, this is very interesting and of course it's always interesting to play something else as an actor. Yes, I think that's. Uh, the fun and also the challenge of this project. Yes. Okay. 
Um, on a more serious note, if you were to be a politician able to change something uh, in this issue of, uh, of aging, what would your statement be? Or would you have one? It's okay not to have one. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's, um, it's a pity um, that um, there are, on the one side there are the older people, on the other side there are the younger people, and uh, maybe I would create I have the possibility I would create something in place or a situation or um, yes, anything, something where you can, where older and younger people can come together and have the possibility to learn something from, from each other and um, to live together more than we do now. There, there are a lot of younger people in my, in, in next to me and not so many older people. So I think it's total separation. Right? There's a lot of, yes, I think in in, in my as a, in my life there's, there's a separation. Of course, I have my, my, my parents and my grandparents, and they're close to me. But but um, the people I don't know when I when I meet people, new people, there are um, most of the times they are they are younger than my age, or sometimes they are ten years older or twenty years older. But um, it would be interesting to to meet more people. Um, older people, really older people, 20 years, 30 years, 40 years, is that possible? Yes, 40 years older people. And um, yes, to hear their stories and to learn something from them. Yes, to have, yes when I would be a politician, I would find something, houses or uh, uh, living projects or places where, where it's, zack, there are all the people together. And the last question, less serious. Uh, if you were the main character in Youth Without Old Age, you know that story. If you were the baby who doesn't want to come out into yes. the world, what would convince you? I, I, there's a lot. I'm, I'm really, I'm really, I'm, I'm really, I'm, I'm, I'm curious, curious about about things, about stuff, and so on. So you can, you can. Um, Give me ice cream, and I would say yes. I, I want to. I want to try one. But um, yes, um, so so it's not so difficult <laughs> to put me into life. But um, as um, what I really like is the sun and the heaven, and the trees and the seaside and all this, and the the, 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 the air, in this world. I love. I love. Yes. I sometimes like. People and all this stuff. I think there's a lot in, in this place to, to what it makes um, nice to be here. It's not so difficult to, to con convince me this is the right way. Great.